What's up guys, it's Coco and today we are going to be having Indian food. <laughs> You guys, I'm so excited. I have been craving Indian food. I told you I was gonna do another Indian food because you guys love Indian food and I love Indian food and I was craving it today. So we're gonna do this again. I have cheese naan over here, lamb biryani. I have chicken josh and chicken tikka masala. I had a lot of chicken because I feel like I'm safer on the chicken side. And yeah, so, so you guys also told me that the proper way to eat Indian food was with your hands. So we're gonna eat with our hands today. Let's start with a cheese naan and dip it in this chicken right here. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. I feel like I need a spoon because I need the chicken. Oh my god, this is so good. Everything is so spicy. The cheese naan is so much better because it's like chewier. Alright, I'm gonna dig in, okay? It's gonna be sore because I have so long nails. Mmm. Oh my god, the lamb biryani is so good. There's so much lamb in here too. Every bite has lamb. Mm. Okay, wow. Better than the chicken biryani. And I love this one. It's spicy. What I love about Indian food is you can always make it mild, hot, very, very hot. Or not hot at all. I always make it very, 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 very hot. Mm. Oh my gosh. It's so good. The rice is getting in my nails, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. I knew this was gonna happen. Let's try this one. I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not sure which one is the chicken josh and the chicken masala. Mm. Mm. They're both good though. So good. The biryani is so good with the lamb. Mm. Yes. I like this one better. I think this one is the chicken josh because it's spicier. It's more buttery, thicker, and like there's much more flavor. The flavor is stronger, I would say. This one's lighter, but it's good too. Everything's good. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. I've been craving this all week. I'm telling you, I crave Indian food now all the time, too. Mm. It's so hot, I can't put my <laughs> hand in there. Can you see the steam coming out? It's so hot. Ooh. 
my heart. Um, sorry, I was trying to see a movie tonight because I don't work tonight and I want to see the, the new The Grudge. I love scary movies, especially like the scariest movies that they made. I think Insidious is so scary. The Grudge during every every no scary movies. I love those. Oh my gosh. Mm, what is that? It's like a cartilage, but it's good. I want to dig in for stuff, but okay, let's try this again. I want to give out my door dasher a shout out, by the way. My door dasher gave me a free bottle of water. It was like, I'm giving out free bottles of water for every house that I go to. Oh my god, that's so sweet. And for like the Uber drivers who have like candies and making their car like a airplane mode. Have like free stuff in their in their seats like candies and waters for the passengers. Oh, I think that's the sweetest thing. Um, yeah. Alright, let's dig in for shit. This is a big chicken. Mm, so good. I'm trying to get everything. And I'm trying to get like... Not my face dirty. Mm. Hot. My food came with white rice. It came, it came like on a container like this. I opened it, and it splattered everywhere here in my floor. Now I have to vacuum with a whole bunch of rice here. I'm so mad. A good thing they're Indian rice though. The rice from like the white rice from India restaurant is like, it's not like sticky. It's like falling over. No, what's the word? It's not sticky, but like, it's like dry, so when it falls on the ground, it won't stick to the ground, so it's dry. I think it's best for that kind of rice for like this kind of stew or meat, so it makes it so like, it would absorb this kind of stuff. <laughs> well, I'm horrible at describing, I'm so sorry. Also, I didn't get any samosas. Because I'm not going to lie. I feel like I don't like them. I'm not a fan of samosas. Mm. This one's also good. The chicken makani, the chicken... Josh and Chicken Tikka Masala, they're all like super close of flavor to each other. But, they're all so good. Oh man, yummy. I feel like I want to try it with white rice though. The food. Chicken. Mm. You know what? Um, in the Philippines, Traditionally, people eat with their hands too. Like the people from long, 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 long time ago. 
like the ancestors, like the old fashioned way. They all ate with their hands too. In the Philippines, mm hmm. And I would say they're all like Pepsi, Diet Pepsi, not sponsored, but I wish. Um, coldest water though, guys. <laughs> free shipping. Use code Coco for free shipping. Um, what was I saying? Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. Um, Filipinos like to have like a big old pot of food too, and like to share. Like they're how they eat is like sharing style or family style, I should say. You know how some like restaurants, they only do like family style serving. Like you go there and like everything that you order, kind of like buka. They have like entrees too. Buka, um, they have like entrees too, but usually when you go to like pastas, the pastas are like 30 to $40 because it's like to share. So yeah, the lamb is better than the chicken biryani. Mm. I'm going to say though, there's like cashew nuts in the biryani. And I don't like nuts on my food. Mm. Where the chicken at? <laughs> Ouch! Ha. We're right down there and it's hot. And I literally forgot to get a spoon, but it's probably for the best. It's like a challenge, you know? Ooh, hot. Hot. I also just got back from the gym. That's why I'm wearing this. I know I just wore this for my other mukbang, but <laughs> I don't want to change because I need to shower. It's perfect to shower after the gym and after this kind of mukbang. <laughs> I have so much cleanup to do though because I spilled so much rice on the ground. Mm. This is so good. I will tell you this, the last mukbang that I had with Indian food, I had so much left over, remember? So I put it in the fridge and first thing in the next morning that I really craved is Indian food. So I ate my Indian food leftover the next morning. <clears throat> and you know how like this is very, very hot and like so much spices. So for me having an empty stomach and eating it as breakfast, I was literally having like diarrhea for like half of the day. Because I ate Indian food for breakfast. But you know what? It's worth that. 
I'm craving like chocolate right now. Mm, I'm so full. But it's so good I can't stop eating. There's so much cashew. Mmm. I just tasted there's raisins too. I don't know about raisins in my rice. But so good. Oh man. Oh man. Hits the spot. Totally hits the spot. It hits the spot when it's really, really, really spicy. If it's not, then it's just like a regular food, you know? Mm. I like everything spicy. I can't flip my hair. Wow. Hands down because it's so dirty. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna be tapping out. I really wanna um wash my hands and myself and clean up a little bit here. I'm so so full. They put so much rice in the container and there's just a lot. A lot a lot a lot a lot a lot of food. So, yeah. All right, guys. I am tapping out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed my Indian food today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye, guys.